Yeah, alrighty. Akron's trailer just came out literally an hour ago, and uh, yeah, <laughs> Akron is actually just coming out tomorrow, so of course I'm gonna be pulling for him. So let's actually, yeah, watch his, her trailer, uh, Your Color, and see if we can learn anything more about her. But alrighty, Akron's trailer, Your Color. It's 2 minutes 50 seconds, and knowing Hoyo, it's gonna blow me out of the water because Hoyo really obviously does like all their trailers super well. I'm gonna put it at the highest quality. Gonna put subtitles on, but I'm gonna make them like smaller. But yeah, really looking forward to seeing what this trailer has to offer us. Okay, <laughs> let's begin. Three, two, one, let's go. Okay, already very different. Ooh, the black and white shit. Ooh. Okay, this already looks good. Whoa, wait, Sparkle? Wait, it is Sparkle. What? <laughs> oh, what the blade? Oh, Sparkle's messing with her. That's what this is. Oh my god, that fucking transition. That's so good. What did you say? Oh my god, bringing all, all, all the cell around on thirst. Oh, this is already sick right off the bat. Our existence is fleeting as dawns do. Destined the second annihilating Electro Waifu. Annihilating the first one. On the still waters of oblivion, our guide. Oh wow, just the way it cuts from 3D to animated. That's such a good transition. I weep for the departed. I am the storm that is approaching. Holy shit. Okay, this may be more insane than the Sparkle trailer. Holy shit. I've seen her before. Uh, yeah, right in May, right? Your end, my origin. All that is past. To oh my god, even the fucking music is fucking hype. Jeez. <laughs> okay, Hoya, we know who your favorite character is. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Holy shit, just annihilate off Panacani, why don't you? Oh my god, I wonder if this foreshadowing, like, was actually gonna happen. Yeah, animated power creep. <laughs> oh. And, uh, I can't, I'm guessing Sparkle's gone now. He's just like, nah, I don't want any of your trauma. I don't want to be end up, I don't want to end up like Black Swan. Oh wait, that's a perfume ad. <laughs> I just realized. Hmm. Also, of course, yeah. <laughs> Every character gets like a custom Star Rail logo. That's cool. Hmm. I do actually wonder though. <laughs> Is Hoyo officially confirming that Akron can actually beat all the Stellaron Hunters at once? Because yeah, Kafka and Blade, I, I, I'm pretty sure are are mega OP. So I wonder if this is their way of telling us, like, yeah, lore-wise, Akron can beat all the Stellaron Hunters at once. Well, then again, St um, Sam is not there. Sam is not there, so maybe... Actually, we never figured out how the duel with uh, Sam went down, huh? Because freaking Black Swan took us out of, of the of the fight, like, before we could even see the conclusion, so who knows? Maybe Sam beat Akron's ass, or Akron beat Sam ass? Who knows? But... Oh my god, this is a fucking beautiful ass trailer. <laughs> yeah, holy, holy shit. Especially this part. Oh yeah, that, that is cool shit right there. Uh, yeah, so... How are we feeling after all? I feel like, yeah, I feel like I'm obligated to pull for Acheron at this point. Also, I've heard a lot of people say that, um... Judging by all the black holes and whatnot, and also, the fact that she always says, like, stuff reduces to nothing. People speculate that she's the emanator of nihility. And not just because of her path, but because a lot of her, the stuff that's going on seems to heavily relate to nihility. At least that's what uh, most people think. 
Sam's a robot, right? No, I'm pretty sure it's, um... No, I don't think Sam's a robot. I'm pretty sure Sam is a man inside of, ro of a robotic suit. Yeah, I wonder if this is gonna be like this for all the emanators going forward. Like, if the emanators are gonna be, like, essentially, like, the Archons in Genshin. Like, they get a special trailer. They're gonna be, like, massively OP and shit like that. And also, yeah, I'm... This is Raiden May, right? Yeah, this woman right here. I, I I think it's a heavy reference to Raiden May, but this is just coming from somebody who has not played Honkai 3rd at all. Yeah, I'm assuming this is a, a reference to that. Eventrine says she is. I don't think Eventrine specifically points out what emanator she is. So, like, she says... Uh, he said it could be, like, Hans, it could be Nihility, or it could be Finality. Which which is one of the eons I know nothing about. Emanator, what's that? An emanator is a, um... From what I've heard... Um, this is from other people, and also the lore in-game. It's essentially an extension of the- of the Eon themselves. Uh, that's what people have told me. It's like, yeah, when an Eon gazes upon somebody and actually gives them, like, a part of their power, they gain, like, yeah, high abilities above, like, normal followers of that Eon. Like, for example, Jing Yuan is, like, an emanator of the hunt, and Fantilia is an emanator of, uh, Nanook the Destruction. Uh, and Akron, yeah, is also an emitter too, so she's about, like, as powerful as them. But the thing is, we don't know what, um, Eon she's an emanator of. So, yeah, that's why, that's why this stream exists, to go through all the Eons, just to see which one she follows. I mean, for all we know, she could be following either an alive Eon or a dead Eon, for all we know. So that is the, yeah, the basic premise of what an, an emitter is. Yeah, it's like an Archon, in a sense, but it carries out the Eon's will. Yeah, I think that's like the best way to describe it. Alrighty, but yeah, that is uh, Acheron's trailer. Holy shit, yeah, it was so well animated. Yep, definitely gonna be pulling for her day one. Oh yeah, just look at this splash shot right here, too. That is so, so good. That, <laughs> I'm gonna be making that uh, probably a thumbnail down the line.